thinking about getting a Hogwarts lower fairings for your uh, Harley Touring? Don't do it. I'll tell you that right now. I've ordered, Hogwarts has some really nice stuff, uh, but I would stick to like the tour packs and things like that. I used their heat shields. Um, it was one of the hardest things I ever did. It just, it, the instructions didn't match what you actually had to do. They never updated it. I had such a hard time with that. Now I've done countless upgrades on my bike from the, the tiniest mod to the most expensive mod. And uh, I've learned most of them from YouTube. I'm handy, but YouTube pretty much taught me all of them. And, uh, or instructions, or videos, whatever. But when it comes to Hogwarts, let me talk about the lower fairings. I'm gonna show you, now I had a pair of lower, lower fairings that I installed when I first got the bike. Pretty easy, and that was one of my first mods, and it was pretty easy. And uh, I did it with no problem. Uh, I had one little issue with it, I ended up wanting to swap them out. So I said, you know what, I'm going to spend a little bit extra and I'm going to get the Hogwarts. So I get the Hogwarts, and I get the uh, speaker pods on top of that, the speaker grills on top of that, and uh, it's pretty pricey. So I get the Hogwarts, so this is the Hogwarts one. Uh, no, it's not the Hogwarts one. So this is the front of the Hogwarts with the speaker pod installed. Now I had it on a bike, it's kind of dirty. The uh, slidey panel, it's a little bigger than the one I had on the other one. There's no dial, you just gotta reach in and grab it. Speaker pod installs nice, no problem. Where the problem lies is on the back. This goes onto the crash guard. This panel goes over it. Actually, it's on the wrong one. But anyway, it goes over it. Now, you see the two holes here? I ended up drilling them out to get a little bit more space. You have two little nuts that go on here, uh, bolts that go on here. Have to match up perfectly in here to get through here to tighten this thing on. This is what holds it on. Then you have one on the bottom, like a little, uh, U clamp that holds to the bottom of the uh, crash guard. Then you got to drill a little hole. You got to drill a little hole to get the uh, speaker wires through. But you have to do that in all of them. So I could not get this on. I ended up popping the back of this. I tried using some JB weld to hold it in. As soon as you go to tighten it, they 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 get loose. And then when I finally got it on, it was still a little bit loose. It just didn't grab good. I finally gave up. And I ordered the same pair, which I'll put a link in the, in the uh, comments. It cost me like 120 something dollars. That came, that came both. Let me show you that real quick. Actually, let's do a quick comparison. This is the Hogwarts. This is the one that I got off of uh, Amazon. They're both weigh about the same. This comes with a built-in speaker pod. You don't have to install the speaker's pod like you did on this uh, Hogwarts. Now, the only difference here is the uh, vent. It's got a little, uh, little switch here to open the vent. The vent area is smaller than that one. That's the only difference. They both weigh about the same. They both look exactly the same. But let me tell you where the difference is. You have one screw. I'm gonna have to take this off to show you. If you have a Harley and you don't have one of these magnetic tool to get lost screws and stuff, don't know what you're missing. Okay. Oops. Okay, on the back, comes with a 
comes with this little jammy right here. It goes on this piece. Just want to compress that a little bit. Kind of put it right down the center. Okay. When you bend it a little bit, it holds firmer. That's not going anywhere. The Hogworks comes with two. Right? But it's so hard to line them up and keep it in there. This has one, okay, which is good, right in the middle. Now this is the best part of this. Comes with a little bracket here. Okay, that bracket goes around the crash bar. So you tighten from the bottom for the U, with the uh, U clamp, you tighten on the crash bar, and you put the one screw through here. You might want to use a little bit of, uh, I use like uh, painter's tape to hold the screw in. And that's it. All you gotta do besides that is drill a hole right here for speaker wires if you run speakers. I'll show you how to do that when I put it on a bike. But basically, this is the comparison for the two. Weight wise, actually this, the Amazon might be a little heavier. They look exactly alike. You cannot tell the difference, except for the vent. Again, it's a little vent on this one, and this one is a little bigger. It's a lot bigger, actually. So that is one advantage. But let me tell you something, when you put it on the bike, it's on there secure. I mean, for a quarter of the price, you're getting something I think is a little more secure. Same construction, looks about the same. Much easier to install than the Hogwarts. So my opinion, don't get the Hogwarts. I'll show you how to install this real quick as a little added bonus. It's not that hard if you use this one, use the Hogwarts, good luck, and I, you better have a lot of patience. Because trust me, it's not easy. If you've done them before, it's probably easier. But if you've never done one, whew, good luck. So let's go put it on the bike. First thing you wanna get is, if you don't have it already, I mean, you can do it other ways. Get a step up bit. You can get like a set of three different sizes on Amazon for like 10 bucks. And it's really easy to drill holes. Like we're gonna drill for the uh, speaker wires. Now you can do wherever you wanna do it. Me personally, the way I did it on the other side, <clears throat> you'll see in here, there's a little groove that uh, I, I drill the hole in here to run my speaker wire through. If you mess up, it's the back of it, and this is behind the speaker, so it doesn't matter. I started on the back, and we'll start, I'm gonna finish in the front. So, you see it a little bit, the little hole there? I don't know if you can really see it. There's no light on it, but if you can't, sorry. <laughs> I don't know if you can catch that. It goes right through like butter. As they say in New York, butter. Oh, don't do that. Nice and clean. I don't know if you can see it. So let's make sure the speaker wire goes through. Might have to go a little wider. Okay. Now the back of this. Let's see if I have the right tool on there. I'm gonna pop off one of them, loosen the other one. You want to make sure that this bottom piece is in front. Like that. Okay. Okay. 
All right, once that's on there, Not back on here. Just want, you can just finger tight it. You don't want to want to make it too tight because you're going to have to adjust this. And you want to make sure this fits right. Position is the point where that's see, see how that fit nice and snug. So you want to make sure this is nice and fits perfectly. You still have a little bit of play here, but you want to make sure that that's right. So with that about here, let's take this off. It's right off. Let's tighten this up. You don't have one of these you don't know what you're missing don't over tighten these that shit is not moving one more time let's make sure this is right before we go ahead and do the hardest part of this whole thing It's not see so <laughs> hold on trust me you don't want to wrestle this later actually it is right okay now that we know that's good we just got to do the bottom clamp too so let's put that on before we do this All right, the Amazon kit comes with two of these washer bolt and nut like I said, I already, I'm already using one from the old one, but they're the same exact thing. It doesn't matter. So you're just going to push this through. You're going to have to get on the ground. Okay. Tape it right to the screw. Not too hard. Just enough that you're not going to drop it because it's a little bit off-centered. And you kind of have to feel in there. tightness trust me because then you bend it right off of the uh, plastic I'm gonna go a little tighter it's not moving but it is moving a little bit so Look at this. I mean, I'm I'm getting on it right now. This is not going anywhere. I still got to tighten the bottom bracket. Okay. All you have to do is attach the speaker. Now here's the uh, the old grill that came in my speaker. Um, I bought it on Amazon separately. That's why I had some chrome on my bike. No more chrome. So basically, it's going to hook right up in there. And. Of my Hertz Neo speakers that are going in. And since I bought everything Hogworks, I'm gonna use the Hogworks grills. If it doesn't go perfectly, you have to drill a little bit. But this is what it looks like when it's done. Oh, guess what? I did the light again. That's what it looks like when it's done. I gotta clean it up, of course. But I put the Hogwarts grill on there. And again, it has to be cleaned. But this is on 
this is not going anywhere so for like hundred and thirty dollars the links gonna be in there I definitely recommend getting the Amazon one it's well made very easy to put on compared to Hogwarts Hogwarts can kiss my ass because I'm not getting anything that involves being put together anymore from them but again they have some nice stuff some nice color match stuff but anything like this this is this is a design issue how they could charge four times the amount of something on Amazon that's so simple and so easy to put together it's just mind-boggling so don't be afraid to order on Amazon sometimes you get some really good deals same stuff same stuff made in China or here I doubt it but whatever four times as much or four times as less four times less with a hundred times less aggravation I would get these whatever maybe I'll, I'll put a little clip on how it sounds when it's done till the next one ride safe Those are the Hogwarts scroll covers on my Amazon stuff. We we'll missed a few spots. I also got a Kraus seat. Haven't tried it out yet. So again, that's grill covers. And that completes my installation of the lower fairings.